Hi there. This is the February 2016 Mid-Missouri Kayak and Weather Report. It's about me 60, 65 degrees. It's supposed to hit 69 or 70 today, near record. And uh, same tomorrow. Yeah. Cooling off comes Saturday, I guess, Saturday evening, possible rain in the evening. But yeah, nice blue skies. Well, not right here. I'm under a rock overhang, but up there. I am on the Moreau River, the Moreau River. I did not expect to be here. I thought I'd be on the Osage. I haven't done that in a while, probably close to a year. And I thought this would be frozen, especially by the ramp. Any time in February I've been here, it's been frozen, but took a chance, came here, and yeah, it's fine. So um, I came here because it's windy as hell, and the Osage being a couple hundred feet across, you know, you're out there in the wind. Here I've got the banks pretty much blocking it, but although every once in a while I can hear it howling or blowing pretty hard up above. I like this stretch. Uh, I like seeing the white sycamore trees. You know, when there's no leaves on them, you can get that white going on. And there's plenty to see. There's a lot of nature. Of course, there is also some unnatural aspects to it, but yeah, a lot of nature. Rock formations, bluffs, that overhang that I was just underneath, and now I'm drifting, actually I'm drifting upstream. It's the way this current is. The water is a good two to three feet higher than I'm used to in the summer. And there are points where I was able to see debris up in the trees 20 to 25 feet from some of the high water we had this earlier this winter. Yeah. Mostly mud banks, but some bluffs along the shore, small bluffs. I went two and a quarter miles. Um, for the most part, well, let's see now. Right now, I am about eh, seven to nine miles from where I launched on the Moro last month. Where that could be anywhere from 100 to 150 feet wide. This is average 60 to 80 feet wide here. And being seven to nine, nine miles away, seven to nine, it's actually more like 15 to 20 following the course of the river. And I went two and a half, two and a quarter miles. I thought I could go three miles with the water level being a little higher because I usually bottom out right around the two mile mark. And as I came up to the highway bridge, I usually stop at, um, I saw that it was river right across, maybe a foot deep. Usually it's only a couple, five, six foot wide channels. And uh, I have to scrape my way upstream past it. I've done that a couple of times. But the water was high enough. And there were a couple spots where 20 feet wide because of uh, the gravel bars on the shore. And in those spots there, I was kind of like paddling in place until I got past the current there. And normally those are actually even narrower, but not as stiff a current just because there's not a lot of water flowing through here in the summer. So, yeah, uh, wildlife, let's see, uh, I saw a couple raptors up high, I think they were ospreys, they weren't hawks, and they were too light to be eagles, I think they were osprey. Uh, one kingfisher, beautiful blue, just going back and forth 50 feet in front of me, just wouldn't hold still for a camera, you know, but yeah. And then, three ducks, that was about it. There's fish in the water, someone's been fishing, I guess, I don't know what else you'd be, well, I don't know. I don't know what you'd be shooting at, but the people around here do like their guns. Yeah. yeah. Maybe they weren't fishing. I don't know. Anyway, yeah. Uh, so it's a beautiful stretch. Ah, let's see what's going on. Uh, well, looking at recent times here, I'm wondering, you know, what I should call this the season of travel? Season of sorrow? You can hear the wind picking up. I'm coming out more in the open. And there goes that bird. Ooh, it's, yeah, I think that's the osprey. Oh, hey, how you doing? Yeah, what was I talking about? Hmm. I'll be right back when I figure that out. Oh yeah, here I am. <laughs> season of travel or season of sorrow? Yeah, really. Um, well, I've traveled back to Buffalo twice flew right after Christmas to spend time with the kids and uh, drove back a couple weeks later uh, for a funeral for an aunt. 
and I just found out the last night another ant passed away. So it looks like I'll be traveling this weekend. I'm not sure if I'll drive Friday, Saturday, or Saturday, Sunday. But yeah. So I really don't want to call it that though. I know what I can call it. The season of appliances. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, sometime around Thanksgiving, New Year, we got a new dishwasher. And then Yeah, was that we got the dishwasher, yeah. And then washing machine died. It's front loader, so we replaced it with a front loader. And then just last week, got a new refrigerator. Got a French door, you know, with the freezer on the bottom, really handy. Uh, doesn't have a water dispenser on it. We were kind of limited on our options. There weren't many that we could find that would actually fit under the, the cupboard over the refrigerator. So, but I'm happy with it. Yeah, we're happy with it. I, uh, since it does not have a water dispenser, it did not have a water filter. And we have softened water. We don't drink it. I had put a reverse osmosis filter system next to the sink. And so I tapped off of that under the sink, drilled a hole through the floor, came back up by the refrigerator, and ran a line. So I had filtered water. So we're going to drink filtered ice cubes. Yeah. yeah. Prior to this, we were just making the ice cubes and sticking them in. We had a, a top refrigerator, a top freezer. So, yeah, I think that we will call this the season of appliances. I've got one more coming up, too. My cell phone. Yeah, two more weeks in. My contract's up. I qualify for a new one. I had taken my other one back to Best Buy. They were able to download some software so they could actually reboot it and get it running again. And I uh, reverted it to factory default settings. So it's actually running faster, you know, because it's not running the new bloated software and operating system. So yeah, but it's still kind of wonky. So season of appliances, season of travel, season of sorrow. Yeah. Well, I am going to head back. I have, will have four and a half miles in when I'm done. So, ciao folks. Vlog on.